Madam Chair, when you're ready. Okay. Well, we'll call the meeting to order. First order business is a roll call. Ms. Payne? Ms. Chaput? Here. Mr. Dribben? Here. Mr. Dugan? Ms. Finney? Mr. Heil? Here. Ms. Kirkton? Here. Mr. Mm -hmm. Klemp is here. Mr. Yokely? Mr. Eppers? And Ms. Johnson? You have quorum. Thank you. Apparently. Okay. Next is the approval of the minutes. They've been distributed. Are there any corrections? There's a did? massive mistake. There is. Jennifer Finney is missing from members present, and John Eppers is listed twice. So I oh. we'll need to add in okay. Jennifer Finney as present and uh, remove John Eppers from present. Okay. So I'd make that motion with the amendments. Okay. Anything else? Okay. Is there a motion to adopt the minutes as amended? I will move. Yes, Second. All, all in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Minutes are adopted. Hey, Joe. Eric, did you see the Jennifer was adopted? I will move her over. Oh. There she is. Can you hear us, Jennifer? Okay, good. No public comment. Still, I'm not using city connect. No governance items. New business was to review the charter recommendation reports that were sent out. Um, and Matthew, you have those on able to screen share. I do. No? Okay. We do. So I, I don't know what the pleasure of the board is. Is To me, it's hard to look at things like that and suggest edits. And I don't know if people have had time to, to look at everything and um, want to make comments. I did send out a PDF and a Word document that you could do at home and comment and suggest edits. Um, but up front, is there anything that sticks out at anybody that they um, have comment on? This one you want or you want the other document? Pardon me? Is this the document you want? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anybody have a comment or is this looking like what you think it should look like? Do you want to spend time with it at home and look it over there? I thought it was pretty good. Um, the one comment I have is really petty and that is the word North Star is used in there. I'm not sure people know what that means. That this is the North Star of our existence, you know, it's okay. kind of a artsy term, it seems to me. That was, yeah, that was one of our um, presentation boards that was in there. But, you know, I don't care really. But, but you know, people don't know, like, uh, service, they think it means military service. So I think the language should be as clear as possible. Anything else? Is impressed. Thank you. Yeah, I thought it captured the essence and the spirit and you know of what we'd all wanted to do and yeah. I think reflected well the discussions and so on. Okay. So I'll just um go with this if you think of things. 
after we leave here today, just send the comment or what you want to consider as an edit. Um, there is a huge addendum to it that I piled all the things that we've looked at and reviewed into a document. Um, so like Matthew, your um, analysis of the monk survey monkey and um, Joe, your conversation with uh, um, so civically. Uh, the, the that's the organization that um, publishes the model yeah. charter. Yeah, yeah. Um, and everything else, it's got everything in the kitchen sink too. So people who have to do this again after us can have a lot of uh, data to look at. Okay, uh, old business, um, any remarks uh, that you all want to insert after the article proposed amendments, um, send them on in. Uh, I've gotten one. Madam Chair? Yeah. Um, uh, my apologies, I, I was on vacation uh, the previous 10 days, so I haven't looked at this very closely yet, but I did, did a quick scan of the uh, write up on the um, wards uh, district uh, at large issue topic. And it, it struck me that, you know, give, given where our recommendation vote netted out, that uh, that section did not make a, 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 a strong, you know, case there uh, as to uh, the hybrid uh, approach that was approved by a majority. And so my question here is, if I were to suggest some language there to address our thinking there, is that appropriate as as part of the formal section, or is that better done as a member comment? I would think a member comment, Joe. Um, you know, it wasn't an overwhelming nine to right. zero vote. Yes. Um, yeah, that's fine. Know. Yeah. Do you all think that's a way, good way to go? Okay. All right. Um, consider consider agenda items for the next meeting. Um, I'll try to have this uh, wrapped up and to you, and hopefully you'll have all your comments sent to me. Maybe if you could do it by October 1st, I will be away from the 2nd through the 11th. Um, and then uh, next agenda item is future crab obligations. And um, I think there will be some update on what, what's expected of us after this report's turned in. I, if you don't mind, I will make one Mm -hmm. uh, first of all, please don't interpret this as you not wanting to let go <laughs> and be free from the time. But my expectation is that this is going to take several months for the council to wade through everything because we have our other business as well. We can't concentrate only on the draft recommendation. And at some point, that may, uh, we may ask some of you who have. On subcommittees to come and help explain reasoning or something like that. Um, the other thing is, my expectation is that council will have a discussion about considering a hybrid system or not. And if the, the uh, council decides that they do want to consider some form of hybrid system to go to the voters, we can't send what we have to the voters, in my opinion. And so there will have to be some sort of either reconvening of this body, some working group that is willing to come to flesh out some proposal. But no one wanted to assign that very large task without being sure that there was a majority of the council who would at least consider sending this to voters. So, yes, thank you for the many, many hours you put in. We're going to ask for a few more, but it wouldn't be, I don't think it's going to be in the Senate. Regular 
any comment? The accelerated deadline was also uh, an issue. So, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> was there yeah, we're November, we're supposed to be due. Oh, you are? Yeah, oh, I we were. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, anything else on that? Um, so I guess. Next meeting dates would probably be on here next. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so the doodle poll, refresh my memory. So the doodle poll, the majority of members can meet on October 2nd. I don't have the time, but there are two members that were not available on October 2nd. Okay. October 12th was the next date, so that's wrong, I apologize. October 2nd, perhaps there was one member that couldn't be available. October 12th, there were two members that couldn't be available. After that, I'm not sure there could be four. October was a very difficult month for each of you. Yeah. Okay. Um, you want to, let's pencil one in, and um, if we don't need it, we can cancel it. You want to do the second or the 12th second? Jean, didn't you just tell us you were going to be out of town the second? I, I will not be here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Either one is fine for me. Okay. And Matthew, you're out. I would be here on the second. You will be. Yeah. Okay. But I won't be here after that. Okay. Okay. Given the chair's absence of time and my not realizing that I have pushed you up two weeks, if you all would like to push back the initial council consideration of the report until November 7th, we certainly can do that. If that would make you all more comfortable. That means I get to keep you longer on the back end, by the way. Well, let's let me um, let me update you like before I leave and, okay. and see how where we are. Okay. Yeah, I, I, yeah Madam Chair, I think yeah, it's just in terms of you know, the compilation and the editing of the document and making sure we have all of our ducks in a row and all of our arguments put together and ma making that possible and, and giving the full crab, you know, the opportunity to review that before we do submission is kind of just time constraints and we've had some vacation schedules, you know, interrupt too. Well, it, my concern personally is you all have invested so much time and energy in this. I don't want my setting an arbitrary deadline, which it's not really arbitrary because of the election pressure, but Understood. setting a deadline um, that makes you all not give us exactly what you want us because you have worked so hard, you deserve to have the final product be something that you want it to be. Yeah, I think it's, in fairly good shape, yeah. uh, just uniform formatting and um, any comments or additions people want to make to it. But I think by and large, it's fairly mm -hmm. well put together already. Madam Chair, I did yeah. want to ask if we can go back to the future dates, which certainly up to this body. But because it was so hard to find a date in October, would it be easier to schedule a Zoom meeting for members to attend or perhaps to look at a different time for a couple of the meetings? Um, well, the 2nd and the 9th were... 2nd and the 12th. At 12th. But we're supposed were. To, and then if we are able to give the report to council on the 17th, we should be okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Anything else for the good of the cause? So just to be, are we meeting on the 2nd and the 12th? Or... I think the 2nd. Uh, okay. Madam Chair, just, I, I mean, you and I had discussed it, but that will be a pretty light staff attendance as well. I'll be at a conference right. and the city attorney will be away as well. Okay. Uh, Mr. Peterson will be here, and I 
trust he can hold down the fort. <laughs> I think so. I don't know. Do you all want to pencil in the 12th just in case? We can always cancel it. Why don't we do that? Okay. I will okay. have them on the agenda. All right. Is there a motion to adjourn? So moved. Second? Tammy, all in favor? Uh, Aye. We're adjourned. Thank you, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> it took me longer to drive here. Yeah. <laughs>